Alright, hey everyone, welcome back to my channel, a little bit of everything. Um, I thought that I would take the time before I went to bed to give you guys a little bit of a house tour, so here we go. I'm not going to give you my address or anything, it's just a quick tour around the house and stuff and what I all have going on and whatnot. Alright, so we will start at the front door. Obviously, this is the uh, front door, um, the front entry, I should say. Um, yeah. This is my plant room as well. As you can see, I have many plants. but my autofocus is not working. Um, so yeah, greenhouse there, a um, little futon to work on, and uh, three pot plants, another greenhouse over there, and uh, a little uh, chair there. So yeah, these are all of my plants in here currently. Propagation stuff is on the top shelf, and everything else is just uh, plants. And the same with this one. See, I got all my pots and cups and stuff that I use to repot. Some avocados down there, and the rest are just spiders. So this is what I call the addition. Um, about 15 by 16. It's a pretty good size space. Um, it's got two windows so you can usually get a pretty good cross breeze, which is nice. Um, there's a uh, closet right there. Uh, obviously you can hook, uh, hang coats and stuff. And then have a little, uh, little half, or not half wall, but a little um, short wall, I guess. Short in depth, I mean. Um, little shelving and stuff up there. Uh, this is the living room. Um, not much to see here other than furniture and uh, plants, but This is the kitchen. Blue cabinets that I may paint. And a little coffee bar over here. Fridge, obviously. Double sink. Dishwasher is in this little nook over here. It's going to turn on the light. This little nook, and then I got the microwave up there, washer and dryer, little pantry over there, and little pantry right there. I'm eventually going to put a uh, freezer over there, and uh, put uh, shelving right here, so a uh, couple of shelves on that side, a couple of shelves on that side, and then a couple of shelves up there. Um, not too many that cabinet, so just a little bit more space. And then I've got some more plants and my avocados. And then you come down the hallway, and we have bedroom number one, which I have fixed up and I'm looking to rent out. Little uh, closet there. Not huge, but it's uh, enough to put some clothes in. And then, yeah, I uh, put up window trim and uh, curtain rod and curtains. Again, a couple plants hanging there. Breaker boxes over there. Put in a new heat register and uh, baseboards and whatnot. Oh, and I uh, painted the door. So that's bedroom number one, a little window in the hallway there. Uh, 
furnace is right there. And this is bedroom number two. That door actually stays open. Again, little closet. Bedrooms pretty much match each other. This one's a little bit bigger. Uh, Plants on the other side. And uh, again with this one, I'm looking to rent it out. So I uh, fix it up. Uh, window, um, uh, trim, curtains, curtain rod, new heat register, and uh, obviously baseboards. So, yeah. Uh, this is the second entry door. I just, I don't really use that one, but it is what it is. Uh, I added this a couple of weeks ago, just as extra storage. I just had all these piled in there before, and then I just added shelves, so it works, works out pretty well. This is the bathroom. Got a very large vanity. Uh, good size oval mirror. I still got to mount that on the wall. And we've got a bit of storage. And toilet and a good sized shower with a rainfall shower head even. Which is pretty cool. And this is the master. There used to be a set of track lights along that uh, uh, wall. You can see the little uh, um, brackets that it used to be mounted on. Uh, there was some uh, uh, burn marks on the uh, tracks so I took them down and just so it didn't start a fire. And eventually there's going to be a ceiling fan right there and another light right there. So I gotta go buy those and run the wires for them. So uh, This is the master. Got my bed set up right there and my desk over there. Uh, a good size closet in there, and uh, the hot water heater is uh, uh, behind that wall right there, and there's this little nook up in the corner, um, above the hot water heater, so I just have my uh, server up there. And then uh, this, is my, this is my desk workstation, this is where I edit all the videos, and and whatnot. Uh, I got my laptop back there. Yeah, that's uh, pretty much it. I used to have this as a spare room, and I had my bed and whatnot in this room, and then I had my office in the first room. So I had my desk along that wall and then uh, my keyboard right there and then some guitars hanging on the wall. But uh, I decided to um, decided to renovate the rooms and rent them out as I uh, could use rental income. So. I uh, decided to do that. I, I debated on whether or not to fix up the big room and rent it out and rent the garage out with it, but I uh, I figured I'd, I'd prefer to do a couple and then I would have the other two rooms, but everyone I talked to said that I wouldn't be able to um, rent the big room out for more than about a thousand dollars a month. Uh, because, I mean, between a bedroom and a garage and a full yard that you have access to, um, they could just get their own place for that price, so. I decided to rent the two small rooms out for $600 a month each. Um, in hopes to make a little bit of extra money each month and to help pay the bills, so. We'll see how that goes. Um, yeah, but that's pretty much it. Um. I could show you the garage, but I'm not going to tonight because it's dark out and that requires a lot of light, so I am going to let you go and uh, we will see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.